very, very simple for the everyday man to kind of work into their routine. What is up? Welcome to I am your host, Mac, and I want to thank you for checking out this content. Let's get straight to it. This is my dude's daily routine. Now, I am a regular person outside of YouTube. I'm going to be fully honest with you. I try to keep this mostly daily. I don't always get the chance to do this, whether it is missing out on getting to wash my face with this or getting to use this. I'm still kind of getting used to this. I do have reviews for both of these products. You can see the full reviews of these, but spoiler alert, if I have a daily routine of it, I think it's safe to say that they made the cut, but I'm a normal human being. I work overnights. I don't always get to use this or this. Sometimes I'm just tired in the morning after a good shower. I just want to hop into bed. So I also have a little one running around. I'm lucky if I get to brush my teeth before I'm downstairs trying to make breakfast for him. So there's one or two days that I'll end up missing, but that's a good thing about the dude's routine. It's quick, it's easy, and it's not something that's going to be detrimental if you miss a day or two here or there. So I will show you what came with my king set for the dude's flex and what came with the crown set for the dude's rise and how I use them every day. So I I just did a clean up shave. I tried my hand at trying to fade this in. Again, I am not a barber. What I like about the dudes is this is the case as well as the charger. There is the charger port there. The actual device itself is seamless and waterproof. I have seen other devices that do similar things to this and a lot of people in my comment section and they're like, it's cheaper. Oh, why are you gonna pay for this? I like this. I have dropped this. this has done the test of time for me. I've seen even in the reviews of the cheaper knockoffs, they don't last, they start turning off. You get water in the charging port and I'm like, why am I gonna keep spending a little less than this and have to buy this three or four times when I could just pony up the money, get this device. And then the only thing that I'm buying is the products. So with the King set, you get the flex itself, the charger, you get all three of the dude's facial products. That's gonna be dude's war, the prime, and the crush. The war is your facial wash. That's what you're mainly gonna use with the device. The crush, this is the bump eliminator. This is as needed. This is not something you're gonna have to use daily. And then this is the facial quench, the prime. And as you can think of the word quench, it is the moisturizer. It's three easy steps, only two that you have have to use routinely and really it's done in about five minutes total so this is the dude's rise the dude's rise comes with the field in the crown set it's very simple you open up this area right there you load it up with the hair serum and the hair serum has some heavy hitter ingredients so you're looking at olive oil fruit oils rosemary leaf jojoba biotin zinc castor oil these are all things that you will see repeated over and over in these hair growth products that are more natural. They have been tested and shown positive results in restoring hair growth and slowing down, if not reversing in some cases, the effects of DHT. If you've done any research into hair loss, male pattern baldness, or any type of hair loss, as you can tell, I've probably done my homework. DHT is one of the main factors that go into this. This is not a miracle device. I am not pretending pretending that this is going to make you go from this to uh, afro in a week. It might not totally restore your hair loss, but these ingredients in the field are known to stimulate and promote hair growth. It's not organic, doesn't claim to be organic, but not only can you get your own hair serums in there, obviously you have to watch the viscosity that you use, but just the ingredients that they put in here made this to me worth it, even if you don't like the device. Now, what does the device do if I'm going on and on about the fields and its ingredients? Well, the device itself has little teeth that you can comb the areas that you want to work on. It's only 30 seconds at a time so if you have patchy beard areas that you want to touch on you have thinning spots in the front male pattern baldness 
anywhere that you want to try to regrow, regenerate hair, slow down hair thinning, these four teeth here, release the hair serum slowly. When you turn on the device with a two and a half second hold, there is that red light technology. If you put it on the skin, it's not something hot, but you can actually feel the red light. The red light technology has been around for over 50 years and has also shown to have regenerative and restoring properties. It helps with healing. They use it sometimes in wound care. Some people that are having muscle atrophy or they need to promote blood flow. But anyway, I've showed you what comes in both kits. This is the King set for the Flex and the Crown set for the Rise. Let me show you how quickly and easy you can get through this routine. And now I'm gonna add a little extra added bonus for us in the ball gang here. Now, I am obviously spraying my face for the camera. Grab the device. You will see there's two different textures on the flex. I like to get the war, which is the facial wash, up in that corner there. One to two pumps. Max, lightly wet the brush. Turn on the device. And what I like about the device is there are modes. There's an up and down. As somebody with a thicker beard, I really don't avoid getting into the beard. A lot of people end up avoiding their beard and treating their face as if their face doesn't continue. I go straight into the beard area there and I haven't had any issues with the hair and it has helped to get away from like flaking, that ir itchy irritation, oil buildup that I have underneath the beard. So I really get in there on the chin. The shape helps to get in areas like here, contoured into the eye socket area, right around the nose. And you really do feel the penetration of that vibration. And just that quickly, that's it. Just wash my face like regular. And if you're not in the ball gang, that's it, that is the wash right there. In one to two minutes, I'm already done with that. Now, if I have some problem areas, I have a breakout, I have a bump or so, that's when you'll see me grab the crush, that's the bump eliminator, and you're just gonna get a little bit out and apply it on the areas. Right now, I don't have any areas, thank God, to deal with, but I have had some experience using the crush. I felt that it did help to dry up the bump itself, and I make the distinction, the spots that I want to eliminate, it helped to get rid of that without leaving the skin dry. This is the Prime, the facial quench, as they refer to it. Moisturizer, again, two pumps. Make sure I get everywhere on the face. Small circles. I try to learn what I can learn from my wife. And just that quickly, that's it. That's the whole routine. If you stop the clock right now and said, okay, I don't have any bumps that I'm dealing with. You're talking about maybe five minutes, six, seven minutes max. It's not a heavy investment in time. Now the extra added for the ball gang, and this is not a daily thing that I'm gonna do, but say I need to wash the baldy. The hair that is alive is the little hair follicles that is in here. And if you do grow out your hair from time to time, if you're not forced into the ball game, you just rock it because you know you want to rock the DMX, you want to rock the Tupac, and you're just rocking it to rock it. You want to take care of what you have. What I've noticed other hair devices for the scalp, they're geared towards a how do I say this? certain hair type and they have very deep spikes which is great for penetrating deep hair like if it was in a deep deep beard that can help you out but i don't have much trouble with the dude's flex just gonna use a little bit of some shea moisture i'm treating it in the same fashion that i treat the facial scrub i just get in here and scrub the scalp. Not only is this relaxing, the massaging property of this, but you really feel like you have a thorough clean. 
And just like with the face, just that quickly I'm done. The bristles make it very easy for you to scrub this clean, pat dry, throw this thing back in its case. And I can throw it on the charger and that's it. What I will say is I don't find myself charging this thing all the time. I've never seen it actually dead because I periodically just kind of just throw it on the charger. It sits on the charger while I'm sleeping. I wake up, it's done. It's only a couple hours to get into a full charge anyway and it's supposed to last a really long time. I've never had it die on me and I use it or I try to use it daily. Of course, the only thing missing there is probably conditioner is what I would put on just to finish up. But it shows you that I use it all throughout the face, into the beard, and on the scalp, which is a little extra added bonus. You feel this rejuvenated, relaxed feeling from using the device. Now, the dudes rise. The good thing about this, this will hold up to six mLs. I've had multiple uses at this time. Still have a decent amount of it there. I still have about maybe three mLs in here now this can be used all over the scalp and into the beard I tend to use it in areas where I'm having either my little sprinkles of grays thinning areas areas that I wanted to grow back so if you're ever struggling with mustache that won't connect or that like patchy look this is what's gonna help you get that full thick beard without those enhancements that painted on stuff that everybody's doing now they only say you only need 30 seconds on an area so if you have the widow's peak hairline and you are just trying to get into these two areas you're talking about a minute you just turn on the device two second hole and you're just combing the area with the teeth the other teeth that are not releasing the serum are the teeth that are gonna vibrate and you can turn off the vibration if you just want just the light and to release the serum, or you can turn off the light and just have just the vibrating. If you're doing the back here, your crown area, maybe you're saying, okay, the crown area is an area you wanna do a full minute between the left and the right side. If you're doing even all three areas, do the math. You're talking about two minutes max. That's pretty much it. You wanna throw in the beard, you're just combing the areas that you're trying to really focus on for about 30 seconds. It's not a heavy saturation. It doesn't leave you greased up. And that is it. I'm gonna show you a close up. You can see a little bit of shine to it, but it's not an oversaturation. It's not a greasy feel on the beard, on the face, on the scalp. Between washing my face, that took about five minutes total, even doing the extra ball game routine of scrubbing the head, add up 30 seconds and maybe some trouble spots. Again, you're talking about a routine that is over between both devices in less than 15 minutes. This is more than sustainable. This is quick. This is easy to work into a routine. It's not very hard to get assimilated to using the device. It becomes second nature like brushing your teeth. You're getting results, if not better than mine, at least similar. While I don't pretend that I am model quality, you can see the results for yourself. I'm happy with clear skin, with my fullness of my beard, the mustache. As you can see, I don't have any gaps in my connections and I don't have to get out a pencil to draw my lines in. So if you are an everyday man, this is something that can work for you. It's not to say it's gonna turn off the more metrosexual people that are willing to put hours into how they look, but this is very, very simple for the everyday man to kind of work into their routine. If you guys have any questions, if you like content like this, hit that subscribe, of course, and that bell notification to know when I upload things like this. Have you had any experience or do you have any questions about the dude's flex and the dude's rise? What are your results with it on the other side of the screen? Until the next time we're cutting up, stay sharp, stick with it, and I'll see you in the next one. It looks like somebody dragged you across the floor at the barbershop.